The CDC announcing the Omicron variant is now the dominant strain of COVID-19. It's made its way here to Central Texas as the first cases are being reported in McLennan and Bell counties. 25 News reporter Andrew Lamparski has more. There was a surprise visitor at the Waco McLennan County Public Health District today encouraging people to get their COVID-19 vaccine. I've actually held some hands while they were getting their shot and it seemed to make it a little easier. But McLennan and Bell counties are seeing another surprise too. This one a little less jolly. Omicron is here and it's going to continue to spread. And there are reports that it is wickedly contagious. While only two local cases are confirmed so far, the real count is likely much higher. There's just no such thing as one case. Uh, there are probably others out there. We'll just have to wait to get we get the word on that. But with the holiday season here, you want to spread holiday cheer, not COVID or flu. Experts recommend taking extra precautions this week if you're traveling or spending time with loved ones. We're blessed with some incredibly warm weather right now in Texas. So um, if possible, have your gatherings outside. Another thing that you can do is wear your mask. And if you're like me, six months out from your last dose, you can also get your booster to protect yourself and your family this holiday season. We are seeing more cases in the community and we are starting to see a small increase in hospitalizations, but um, probably around Christmas and probably New Year's is when we're gonna see a big spike. Experts believe that while Omicron is highly contagious, it will also prove to be a much milder variant than other versions of the virus especially if you're vaccinated. But don't let your guard down just yet. Andrew Lamparski, 25 News.